Across the Lone Star State are seeing a rise in their inmate populations, and that includes here in Brazos County. At last check, there were 710 people incarcerated at the Brazos Valley, Brazos County Jail, its highest number since 2018. News Donnie Tuggle is digging deeper into the numbers to explain the trends. Typically, jail populations across the country dip during winter and spring months and tick up in the summer. Except for this year, data released by the Public Safety Lab at New York University shows a steady rise in people behind bars after a significant decrease seen during the pandemic. Jail populations declined about 30, 35 percent on average across the country. Um, and over the past now, you know, almost three years, uh, jail populations have pretty much been steadily increasing, um, including this past year. The Brazos County Jail is no exception, reaching population levels not seen since 2018 and expected to rise. College Station Municipal Court Judge Ed Splain says the rise could come from a number of reasons. A lot of these uh, kind of behavior type crimes, public intoxication, fighting, assault, assault family violence, since COVID, we've seen a steady rise of that. Judge Splain says a good portion of the offenses seen in Brazos County are lower level offenses, which could impact the overall data because of the constant intakes and releases. That moment you look at it in time, there's going to be people in jail. Uh, because once pe people are arrested, they have to see a magistrate. The magistrate has to determine what their bond is. Then they have to bond out if they um, can make that bond. Honey Tuggle, News 3. Officials with the Brazos County Sheriff's Office say they're nowhere near being overcrowded and they still have plenty of beds remaining, but they do expect to see a rise in inmate population as we get closer to the summer months. Another place.